Hey everyone, it's Ivan with Kibadger.com, here to bring you part 7 in the To Build a Fire series. And today, I've got this little guy, which is the Doan Magnesium Fire Starting Tool. This series was inspired by the book by Jack London, To Build a Fire. Ultimately, the guy's up in the Yukon, he's in a bad way, and he needs to get a fire lit to save his life. To that end, we've all lit fires, whether it's at a campsite or in a fireplace, pretty easy. But once you start adding other factors in, it gets exponentially more difficult, such as being cold and wet. So to that end, I'm going to give this guy a try today. And it doesn't have a striker, so I'm going to have this as well, a pocket knife. Both these are going to go in my pocket. I'm going to go into the water. Consequently, going to be pretty cold and wet when I come out. I'm going to try and get this fire started. By way of a control, I essentially have a 12-inch piece of 2x4 split up pretty good and a single sheet of paper. So I'm gonna take a dip, come out, see if I can get this guy going. Good news, bad news. Start with the good news. It's actually relatively warm today. When I say warm, I mean it's about 40 degrees out. Pretty warm. Bad news is the lake's literally frozen, which means I'm gonna have to bust through some ice in order to get down into the water. So. It's gonna be pretty chilly, but ultimately, gonna get this party started and see if I can get a fire going. Looks like there's a little weak spot in the ice right over there, so I'm gonna get a big ass rock and try and bust that open. Oh, shit. Oh. Did not make it. Damn it. It's not coming back out. All right, I found a smaller, big ass rock that I should be able to throw further. Hopefully, bust it. Damn it. All right, let's just do this either way. Spoiler, it was cold. Whew, let's do this thing. Oh, oh damn it. Always, always get my paper wet. So because this is wet, the magnesium is just kind of clumping up and sticking to the blade, but not ever. We'll see what we can do.
<sighs> so what the hell happened, right? Well, ultimately, I think I ended up getting my paper a little bit damp. And then I was just off to a rough start trying to figure out which side of the uh, knife I want to use. Didn't really want to use the blade on the uh, ferro part, but it ended up being kind of the best thing going for me. And ultimately, yeah, getting this paper damp set me way far behind the power curve to the point where even when I would get the magnesium to flare up and it burn hot and fast, it didn't have enough to uh, get this paper started. So consequently, couldn't get my wood started. Consequently, pretty cold. So, oh well, it is what it is, but I'm gonna go get warm and change. And as always, thanks for joining us at kitbadger.com. Look forward to seeing you next time.